Hello guys, Survival Scout here and today we're gonna see the survival story of Marvel Prospery. So Marvel Prospery attended the Marathon de Sables, which is one of the toughest marathons around the world. Why? Because it is a 6 day and 156 mile marathon held in Sahara Desert in, in southern Morocco. There it's the place that only the craziest fucking runners go. So this guy decided to go there to test his abilities and take his chances. After running for 4 days he managed to get the 7th place when suddenly a storm arose. The rules was that if a sandstorm hits the marathon then the runners should stop and wait for assistance. But Prospery of course decided to deal with the sandstorm and run through it. Besides a little sand never hurt anybody. He wrapped a scarf around his head and kept on running. When the storm stopped 6 hours later Prospery found that he was lost deep somewhere in the desert, completely alone in one of the world's largest and most inhospitable deserts. Prospery had no choice but on keep walking. He even peed in his bottle to preserve the fluids of his body. Eventually he stopped at an abandoned shrine and then he made the decision, the final decision, to catch two bats, cut off their heads, drink their blood and with their teeth to slice his wrists. Thankfully he was so dehydrated that his blood had actually thickened to the point where his cut wrists were unable to bleed out. When he awoke with nothing but a couple of beating scars and headache, he felt confident and decided to fight for his life and for the next 5 days Prospery continued to push through the desert eating lizards, scorpions and drinking the dew of leaves until he met a, a group of Normans who said him that he was in Algeria 130 miles from where he was supposed to be. Did he survive? Hell yeah! Two years later he managed to complete the run and scratched AF. So his mistake was that he went against the elements and that got him lost in the middle of nowhere. Drinking his urine was his only chance of getting some fluids but generally it is bad. A desert and especially Sahara is a really really bad place to get lost. Though you're being dehydrated really fast even without doing nothing. What you should do is to know that you can stand for 3 days under normal circumstances without water, but in a desert with so much heat in your head and so much tiredness, you will stand a day or two if you are lucky. So guys that was the video, thanks for watching, please like, share and subscribe to this channel for more videos, see you this Monday with a brand new video on this channel. Hey!